Hey guys, how's it going? Look, I know, I know, I know. The Alpha AK from Kleshnikov USA. Yes, I get it. I, I seen the pictures. I seen the video from 2016 SHOT Show with Iraq Veteran 8888. Um, what's his name? Uh, the, the AK Operators Union with Rob. Yes, I seen it. But I haven't really seen it in action. And just from cosmetic looks alone, I don't really care for it too much. Uh, it looks like a looks like a nerf or a toy or a, like what like an airsoft toy something that you'll find from nerf i just I, I just don't really care how it looks too much i have an alpha clone ak and i put a lot of money into it and i love it man it, it runs like a champ and that video is going to be coming out i'm working on that right now um but anyways some people decided to send me some links to check it out oh it's an action okay in action it looks like shit either way but that's just me so so i guess uh, we're going to watch this video and see see it in action so let's let's go <laughs> that music ak alpha all right that's the uh, an original ak Pretty cool. I, I I like the original AK. You know, some people give me shit about it, but whatever. See what I mean, you guys? It, it seems it seems like a Nerf or something, something like an airsoft toy. I I don't know how that rail system works, but okay. What is with that? I I never get why the Israelis have to chamber around first and why they don't have it already chambered already. Because I've seen that many times, especially on the Jericho where they pull it back for the charging, or not charging handle, but the uh, slide for the Jerichos and any, any firearm. Oh. Apparently it shoots faster. You can... You can definitely change that if you get a trigger, a better trigger, like a ALG trigger for your AK, and there you go. Shooting 10 feet away, but that's cool. I hate that monitor. I hate that board grip or that whatever that is. I hate that so much. Side folding stock. That's cool. That's cool. So he's not even really shooting it, but whatever. Cheek riser, adjustable. Ooh! And these safety selectors. That's cool. Is that? Okay. to customize it the way you want. All right, let's pause it right here. All right. Guys, I like I said, that's cool, I guess. You have to take three shots 10 feet away to take out the balloon, I guess. But um you here's the thing that I find a downside with it. You don't get to customize it the way you want. Everything's already there. Yeah, like I said, you don't really get to customize this like you do with a regular AK. You can put in what kind of trigger you want, what kind of pistol grip, what kind of rails. You have so much to pick from. With this, everything's built in, so you're kind of left with whatever whatever is available, I guess. And I know some people are fans of the key mod rails, some fans of the um, what you mean, jig it, the key mod M lock. With me, uh, personally, I like uh, Zenico right there. I love Zenico's rails. I think they're awesome. They're really well made and durable. But to be honest, I just don't really care for this. So that's my view on it, guys. So peace.